Lymphoma is not a single disease. Lymphoma is a group of malignant neoplasms, which arise from white blood cells, specifically from B and T lymphocytes. Lymphoma originating from the lymphoid tissues, mainly in the lymph nodes. Lymphoma is now the fifth most common cancer in the United States. Broadly, lymphoma is classified as Hodgkin lymphoma and non-Hodgkin lymphoma. 90% of lymphomas account non-Hodgkin lymphomas, and only 10% is Hodgkin lymphoma. Hodgkin lymphoma is more predictable, while non-Hodgkin lymphoma less predictable because it has many subtypes with various prognosis. The most common subtypes of non-Hodgkin lymphomas are diffuse large B-cell lymphoma, about 30%, and follicular lymphoma, about 20%. All other non-Hodgkin subtypes have a frequency of less than 10%. Diffuse large B-cell lymphoma is the most common form of non-Hodgkin lymphoma among adults. This cancer occurs primarily in older individuals, around age at tilde 70 years. Sometimes occur in younger people and rare in kids. It is very aggressive form of lymphoma. Important risk factors for diffuse large B-cell lymphoma are Immunodeficiency, infections with the Epstein, Barr virus, Kaposi's sarcoma-associated herpes virus, human immunodeficiency virus, and the Helicobacter pylori bacterium. The most typical presenting symptom at the time of diagnosis is a mass, that is rapidly enlarging and located in a part of the body with multiple lymph nodes such as the groin, armpits, or neck. Common symptoms include, such as weight loss, night sweats and fevers. Such symptoms is called systemic B symptoms. Fatigue in in 33% of cases, unexplained elevations in blood levels of lactic acid dehydrogenase and beta-2 microglobulin in many cases. Diagnosis of diffuse large B-cell lymphoma is made by removing a portion of the tumor through a biopsy, and then examining this tissue using a microscope. Treatment. First-line therapy consists of combination of rituximab, chemotherapy drugs, cyclophosphamide, doxorubicin, and vincristine, and a glucocorticoid, either prednisone or prednisolone. After treatment, return of the diseases called relapse occur within the first three years of diagnosis. Diffuse large B-cell lymphoma is fast-growing cancer and it is fatal if left untreated. With treatment, five-year survival rate is 73 to 74 percent, in case of localized disseminated with regional lymph nodes. But if there is distant metastases, five-year survival is 57%. Follicular lymphoma is the second most common non-Hodgkin lymphoma. Follicular lymphoma has broad and extremely complex clinical picture, with a wide range of manifestations. Most commonly, presents as asymptomatic swelling of lymph nodes, in the neck, armpits, and or groin. Less often, it presents as a gastrointestinal tract cancer, a cancer in children involving lymphoid tissues of the head and neck area. Follicular lymphoma typically has a slow disease course, which persists essentially unchanged for years. However, each year 2-3% of FL cases progress to a highly aggressive form. These transformed follicular lymphomas are essentially incurable. Generally, the disease has an indolent and prolonged course with a median life expectancy of 15 to 20 years, a large percentage of patients die from other causes than their follicular lymphoma disease. Median survival has been tilde 4.5 years after the onset of this transformation. The median age at diagnosis is about 60 years and there is a slight female predominance. It can develop at early ages also. Younger age patient survival rate is high but life expectancy is still significantly less than general population. The most common chemotherapy used for B-cell non-Hodgkin lymphoma is ARCHOP, which is a regimen of four drugs, cyclophosphamide, doxorubicin, vincristine, and prednisone, plus rituximab. Hodgkin lymphoma, HL, is cancer originates from white blood cells, more specifically arising from germinal center B-cells. May be presented without symptoms or with symptoms. Symptoms including fever, night sweats, weight loss, fatigue, lassitude, sometimes enlargement of the spleen, and hepatomegaly. The most common site of initial involvement in the neck region. Cervical, supraclavicular, and anterior mediastinal lymph nodes. 
often non-painful enlarged lymph nodes, lymphadenopathy, in the neck, under the arm or in the groin. Affected regions may be itchy. Enlarged lymph nodes sometimes noticed on a chest radiograph. Pain following alcohol consumption, but this symptom is uncommon. Cause and risk factors. About half of the cases of Hodgkin lymphoma are due to Epstein-Barr virus, EBV. Those infected with HIV infections have a higher incidence of HL relative to an uninfected population. Increased risk in smokers. There are five types of Hodgkin lymphoma, nodular sclerosis classical HL is most common in almost 70% of cases. Diagnosis. Diagnosis is by finding multinucleated reed Sternberg cells, RS cells, and lymph nodes. Hematologic findings include, normocytic anemia, presenting symptom 40% of cases. Chest pain, cough, and dyspnea usually indicate the presence of a large mediastinal mass or metastasis to the lungs. Primary factors that determine the prognosis. Clinical stage is more important than the type of HL. Majority have lymphadenopathy above the diaphragm, stages 1 and 2, which correlates with an excellent prognosis. Increased risk for developing second malignancies, usually acute myeloblastic leukemia. Increased risk is related to treatment with radiation and alkylating agents. Majority are curable. Poor prognosis correlates with age greater than 45 years male gender. High stage, large mediastinal mass, and abnormal complete blood count, anemia. Lymphopenia. Radiotherapy and chemotherapy are used depending on the stage of the disease. The percentage of people who survive 5 years in the United States is 86%. 0.2% of people are affected at some point in their life. Characterized by bimodal age distribution in HL. First large peak is 15 to 34 years old. Second smaller peak is greater than 50 years old. Stage I is involvement of a single lymph node region. Stage 2 is involvement of two or more lymph node regions on the same side of the diaphragm, 2. Stage 3 is involvement of lymph node regions on both sides of the diaphragm. Stage 4 is disseminated involvement of one or more extra lymphatic organs.